Hi, I'm Tony. Welcome to Sports Bike Shop's video about the Climb Tech Pack Rucksack. Climb are best known for their genuine adventure kit, but this tech pack rucksack is designed to be a travel pack, so it's more aimed at riders who are covering big distance rather than riders who are hacking down a green lane. If you're the sort of rider who wants bells, whistles, singing and dancing, then the tech pack rucksack is aimed squarely at you. It does more than any other bike rucksack I've seen in 20 years of riding, and it's hard to imagine what it doesn't have to offer, although actually there are a couple of omissions and I'll get to those later in this video. The main compartment to this bag has a 21 litre capacity and you get to it via a zip that goes all the way around the outside. It opens up like a clamshell and it's really easy to get inside and there are a couple of elasticated supports here that stop the bag flopping open completely when it's loaded. On this side here, there's a wide range of compartments that carry everything from a business card through to a 15 inch laptop. There's also a pouch here where you can stash in a D3O back protector panel and then there's a mesh line pocket here to tuck away light bits and bobs like neck warmers. You can also hook your keys on there so you can keep them safe while you're on a trip. On the other side, there's a larger mesh pocket. People always say that's for dirty washing, but I've never seen why I'd put my dirty washing in an area where the stink can then pollute everything else in my bag. But maybe that's just me. There are four elasticated pouches to either side of that main section, and that's where you can tuck small water bottles to keep those safe while you're riding. There's way more of interest on the outside of this bag though. On the padded section that sits against your back, there are three loops that let you feed straps through there and then you can secure the bag to your bike. There's a hidden pocket just at the base here, so you can tuck in there crucial stuff like a passport or your travel documents, and that means it's gonna be much harder for pickpockets to get to that because it's sat against your back and it's kept out of the way nice and discreetly. And then there's one of the genuine standout features of the Tech Pack rucksack. It's the chest brace that comes with chest protector inserts. So that's CE approved impact protection, D3O inserts that zip in or out of these mesh pockets. Climb say you can take the armor out to make room for a smartphone instead. You can take the armor out, but you don't need to to get your smartphone in there. There's plenty of stretch in this material and you'll get both in there unless your phone is an absolute beast. The chest brace then clips up across the front to support the bag's weight, and then the height on this is really easily adjusted. First you use these tabs to get the height of this brace correct, and then these tabs at the side, pull those tight, and that'll stop the chest section from slipping back up towards your neck as the weight tries to pull the bag back down your back. Turning the tech pack over really shows the most eye-catching features about this bag. You've got a load of clips on the outside, and this one here reveals the helmet carrier section. Just pull that up and then this section here comes out and then you can tuck a helmet away in there and then it secures in place with this hook, which just goes under there again. The lower clips here then hold down the bottom of this wire cable lock that runs through the loops on the outer to store it. This can be used to lock the bag to your bike if you have your own padlock, which then secures through these loops at the bottom. It can also secure a jacket to your bike if that's something you want to do. I'd say that is only ever gonna stop an opportunist bag snatch, and also it doesn't lock the bag shut, so the contents are still really easy prey if you leave this bag on your bike. Continuing with the outside, there are two more bottle pouches on the sides, one on each side, and there's a zip over pocket here that's ideal for stashing away a pair of goggles. And then this pouch at the base gives it a decent amount of storage inside because it extends up inside the bag here. That's where one of those emissions I mentioned earlier comes in. There's no waterproof storm hood. That's what I was expecting to find in there. This bag's only listed as water resistant, not waterproof. It's 200 quid. And for that sort of money, I would feel entitled to there being some way of making absolutely sure that my stuff stays dry. The other omission is something that's raised by the adventure bike community really, and that's that there's no obvious option to fit a water bladder. You could put one in the helmet holder section behind here and then route a feed tube around externally to come around to your mouth, but that's a bit of a bodge really, rather than having a neat way of integrating a water bladder. For some riders, that ability to have a supply of water on their back for a day's riding is crucial, and its absence on that bag will leave them looking elsewhere. 
Whether the Climb Tech Pack is for you or not will come down to the sort of rider you are. People who want simplicity and speed, I think, will struggle with this bag. Our warehouse manager, Ant, would, I suspect, be tearing out what's left of his hair if I made him use one of these bags. Yet, people who don't mind fiddling around with stuff and want loads of bits and bobs would be in their element with one of these. Our IT bloke, James, he'd probably love having this bag and he'd spend hours working out exactly how to get the best from it because there are loads of features to this, probably more than I've even been able to show you in this video. My opinion for what that's worth is that this bag's really comfortable and supportive and I really like that chest protection across the front. I think that's a great idea. But as a bag, I find it a bit fiddly and a bit overcomplicated to use. But as I said, that's just me. I hope that tells you everything you wanted to know about the Climb Tech Pack rucksack. But if there is anything you'd like to ask or to add, then please pop a comment below. Thanks for watching.